Let's get down to business. It is time that I come back to content creation. I have taken too long of a break and attacking toucans, people just, they kind of need it for whatever reason. The, the, the doctor said that people need daily attacking toucans. Like how does the old tale go? And attacking two cans a day keeps the doctor away. No, it was attacking two cans a day keeps the the gynecologist away. Yeah, that's right. So yeah, if you want to keep your vagina nice, fresh, and healthy, make sure to get your daily dose of attacking two cans content, which I'm gonna try to make <laughs> exist for you guys to watch. Because if I don't make content, then that pretty much automatically means you guys are gonna have bad vagina health, and we do not want that. So here I am, and I am starting this off with. The craziest randomizer randomizer I've ever done. So the way this is gonna work, I have seven randomizers of all of the games I've done randomizers of so far. We have Ocarina of Time, Majora's Mask, Wind Waker, Twilight Princess, Minish Cap, Pikmin, and Super Mario 64. And then we also have a wheel that is going to help us choose which game we're gonna be playing first. And over the next seven days, I'm going to try to complete all seven randomizers while we're just like switching to the randomizers up and keeping things random as heck. We do have a beautiful progress tracker right here. We are currently on day one, hour zero. We just started the stream about 10 minutes ago and we are about to choose what randomizer we are going to play. So the stream started at four hours long and in the first 10 minutes of the stream, it got extended up to 12 hours long. So. We're definitely gonna have at least one full day of playing randomizers. That's all I know. And I don't don't think I should dwaddle anymore. I think we should just go ahead and choose what randomizer we're going to be playing. So let's go ahead and pick it up. Um, and it's not Pikmin. We're gonna respin this wheel. And number one is Legend of Zelda Minish Cap. Aw, it's actually kind of cute. I I'm really excited for this. This is, a, this is a pretty pure one to, to start with. Okay. You guys ready to cap it up? We're gonna play Minish Cap. No cap. Actually, Minish Cap with cap, for sure. But yeah, chat's going wild for Minish Cap. Honestly, before we get playing, chat, do you wanna be on screen for the subathon? Do you guys wanna have some representation? It'll take me like two minutes to add you on screen, but I feel like you'll probably want that. Yes, you guys want some representation. Okay, let me go ahead and add you guys to, to the stream. Let me see, do I have chat anywhere on here? Or am I gonna have to like go and copy it from scratch? I might have to copy it from scratch. Oh look, it's my Switch. Switch, Switch, bitch. Another one in the casket. Oh, something else I'm going to do this summer is I'm going to do this series called, I'm going to call it NES Randomizer, Super Nintendo Randomizer, Nintendo 64 Randomizer, Nintendo Switch Randomizer. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to have like a bunch of games as options to play from like that console. And I will randomize which one I play and just make like a one-off video based off of what the randomizer says. And we'll kind of just make like one-off content over random ass games that way. Because why, why the heck not? How's Slay the Spire? Slay the Spire is amazing. I play this game way too much. Um, okay, real fast. Let me add chat to the screen because you guys deserve to be seen. Let, let me test alerts again. Is that a good spot for alerts? I think that's a good spot. <laughs> This is a test donation for $86. Whoa, what? Someone just donated $86? Did the timer not go up for that though? I don't know if the timer went up for the 86. Thank you so much though, whoever that was. One second. You don't think it did? Well, fortunately I can manually add time. So it's not the biggest deal. $86, that makes it go up by 86 minutes, right? Oh wait, that wasn't real. That was... Oh, never mind. <laughs> this is a test donation for $49. <laughs> 
I just got fucking trolled by my own fucking, by my own test alert. I got trolled by my own test alert that I activated. I activated it. And, uh, oh my gosh. I need to open a window. My brain's already getting fried, guys. <laughs> I was like, oh, there we go. The widget's broken. No, the streamer is the one who's broken in this situation. <laughs> I was like, hold on, real quick. I'm going to read your donation. Thank you. I'm just trying to chase it. There wasn't a donation. That's... <laughs> okay, sick. Well, it looks like we have Minish Cap open and ready to go. This is actually pretty great. Um... Also, another cool thing that I think you guys will appreciate is I will be able to unhide the tracker map so you guys can like see the tracker whenever I'm in tracker mode because this isn't a let's play. I can't just like cut out the times where I'm thinking and looking at the tracker. So you guys are going to get, you know, full clairvoyance. You're going to see the whole entire thing. You're going to see me try to figure these bad suckers out. But let's be honest, it's going to be easy because I have, first off, my massive, like, $89 IQ brain. And then I have chat. Chat's real, real smart. Okay. Let me just rearrange my windows and we will start playing this first randomizer. All right. And here we are for the very first randomizer that we got selected. The Minish Cap. We have chat on screen. They're looking great. We have 12 hours remaining. That is definitely enough time to finish Minish Cap. Although, actually, I just realized one other thing. I was going to re-randomize the game every uh, $500 risen total, which I think is every eight hours added to the clock. And so we've already done that once. <laughs> so there needs to be an increment. Let's say... Every $500, I have to re-randomize the game I'm playing, which is every eight hours added to the clock. And I have to, uh, I get to play each one for a minimum of 30 minutes. So that means I get to play Minish Cap for 30 minutes before we have to re-randomize it. And I have to save Minish Cap and then start whatever one gets selected next. Okay. That being said, let's get into it. We're going to start playing some Minish Cap, baby. Are either of these controllers connected? They should be. They were connected yesterday. Controller. Controller. Good thing there's like only five buttons to bind total when it comes to Game Boy Advances. <laughs> Literally. Okay, here we are with Minish Cat. Can we play? Thank you. We're out here. Oh. Should I use a random name generator? I probably should. Hey Siri, give me a random name. Hey Siri. Good afternoon. What should I name my baby? What should I name my baby? How's that audio, guys? What should I... Hey, Siri. My baby. Siri, my baby! What should I name my baby? I didn't get that. Could you try again? What? What should I name my baby? Here's what I found. Ah, uh, you're so unoriginal. God damn it. I thought Siri was gonna make this way more interesting, but she definitely isn't. Yo, what's up, Qual? How's it going? Find your baby name. It shouldn't be this hard to find a baby name. Um. Random name, no, this one, this one sucks. This one has too many options. Whoa, what's up, Qual? Thank you so much for the, for the cheers. 
a thousand bits. We're almost at 13 hours. Let's go. Character name generator. Can we just give me a name? I got the name Hazel. <laughs> Let's go with that. I'm pretty sure that's the name of like the cutest chipmunk in Animal Crossing. We're gonna have a lot of names to keep track of on this. I'm gonna add an accent over the E just to make it seem fancier. Hazel is gonna be her name. Yo, what's up, Zell? And we got our rainbow hearts. Any options? Let's put message speed to fast. We'll stick with normal brightness. Did it save? Now it did. All right, randomizer number one is off. Whoa, we had a go No, I don't want to take a rest. We had a Goron sniffing our ass for a second. Hell yeah, we have a Goron friend. Okay, what should the Goron be named? That's another important question. He's gonna be with us this whole entire trip. <laughs> Goron daddy. Oh, oh yeah, I, I randomized all the rupees on this too. Did I turn that option on? The, the rupee randomizer option? Yes, I did. Okay. What is this? Pegasus boots as the very first item? That's freaking awesome. And 50 rupees? And the smith sword. Wait, why did I find that so fast? That's some, like, really good luck. Okay. Sure. Let's mark that. That honestly opens up, like, let me show you guys the map. Let me show you how this map works. So this is what we start off with. The green dots are the things that we can do at the moment. Orange dots means there's some chests there that we can do, but not every chest in that option location is option like is it something we can do. And I actually don't know what the blue dots mean, but I'm sure they have a really important use. And then once we select what item we use, it'll highlight the new options we can do on the map. And that's kind of the way you can play randomizers and keep track of what you're doing, is these dots just kind of keep track of everything. If you didn't know that these maps existed and you thought that I just knew these Zelda games that freaking well when I played these randomizers, then, haha, fools. It worked. My plan worked. The blue dot is where you go when you're sad and it makes you happy. Oh, The happy blue dot. Blue means you can get there with glitches. Oh, okay, I learned something new already. Well, I do not know any glitches for Minish Cap, so that will not be happening. Alright, how many bushes do I want to get down? Do I want me to get the, the easy money? Is there a portal here yet? No. A portal appears here later. Where am I going to put chat on? Where's the best place for chat? I think right here is the best place for chat. Chat, what emotions are you feeling right now? What thoughts and emotions are going through your head? Oh, hell yeah. We can already pass the little branches. Thank God we got this sword so early. That's like a freaking S tier item to find this early into a rando. You're feeling the stages of grief. That's that's sad. Hopefully we can make you feel better. <laughs> Fraze is feeling fear. Wait, <laughs> is my stream scaring you? Or is there like a murderer in your house trying to like sneak through your house and take you out and you're trying to comfort yourself by watching my stream? I'll try not to say anything that makes you laugh so the murderer doesn't hear where you are. Wolf Lady's feeling excitement. Let's go. Positive emotions. That's what we love to hear. You're feeling broke but enjoying the ride. No, I'm feeling pretty broke myself. But hopefully, after a seven day subathon, I won't feel that feeling anymore. feeling glad because you finally got to catch a randomizer stream. Hey, that's what's up. You didn't find just a randomizer stream. You found the randomizer stream. Oh no, the Goron has Ligma. How come these randomizers keep giving Goron Ligma? 
I actually know why that's happening. The reason the Goron's changing colors is the color that's used for a lot of the character models is a color that's used specifically inside this house. And that color is like replaced whenever you enter this one building due to like limitations. I think it's because of this woman's dress right here. The color of her dress is like a color to where they had to remove another color possibility whenever you enter this room. Some, yeah, something wild like that. But it's, it's not too... It's not too troubling. Nothing to worry about. It only happens in that one house. It's not gonna happen anywhere else. Swift Blade, finest swordsman in all of Hyrule. Uh, please. Teach me your way, Swift Blade. Teaching us the spin attack. Yeah, I know the spin attack. Yeah, it's one of them where you stick it up your ass and spin it all the way around. And he just did it himself. We got the tiger scroll and a piece of heart. Am I supposed to mark heart containers or heart pieces with this thing down here? You don't have trays open for the sting things? Uh, they should be open, but I don't think it's going to really affect us right now. Okay, so I don't think I need to mark that. Hey, you're celebrating your new cat, Darunia. That's freaking awesome. Does your new cat look anything like this cat right here? Is it gray and ashy? Look like a storm cloud? Yo, this mailman needs to back up. Hella quick. Yo, Darunia! Holy shit! Is that what you were celebrating? <laughs> Let's go, cat subs. I love cat subs. Honestly, the best type of subscription is a cat sub. Morale. Pizza heart. Oh, there's a there's a poll for the Gora name. What are you guys choosing? We have four options: Bubba, Dwayne, Rocky, and Roscoe. Not bad options. Here, let me let me vote for myself. I'm gonna keep my vote anonymous though. This guy looks rather depressed. Hopefully we can help him out. Right now I'm just kind of running around aimlessly, just kind of reminding myself what Wind Waker's like while also trying to remember how to be a streamer, because it's been a pretty la pretty long time. I don't know why I keep on speaking in a country accent. It keeps on like poking through for whatever reason. Not intentionally though. It's the bell ringer. Oh, I forgot we have Pegasus boots. This is like the best item to get early because the Pegasus boots just allow you to run really quick around the whole entire game. He's a runner, he's a track star. Aren't these trees supposed to be open? I remember last time I played a Minish Cap randomizer, like I could automatically go inside these trees. But maybe I selected an option that makes it so it doesn't happen. Oh shoot, I forgot to add my subathon uh, commands. Let me add that real fast. Okay. I put up a subathon thing so it should work now. There it is, nice, look at me, look at me go. Look at me stream, I'm such a streamer. This is like a cross between Link's Awakening and Ocarina of Time. Yeah, this game, oh, the Goron's name is Dwayne. You guys chose, you guys decided, you voted, you toted, and that is what we ended up with. We have our boy Dwayne, the Leaf. Johnson. Uh, Dwayne the Paper Johnson. Oh. Okay, I am rather confused. What option do I... Oh, no. Did I turn on the option to where I have to do the Kinstone Peace Fusion? Oh no, <laughs> I might have screwed myself. I, I'm i not really used to setting up this randomizer, but I might have to do the keystone pieces. That's, that's pretty freaking wild. 
Yo, Paul with many voices, thank you so much for the sub. I appreciate you. Justic, thank you so much for the, the Prime Gaming sub. Whew, I hope I don't miss too many things. Do kinstones? Okay, well that explains why the trees aren't some like I, normally you can go inside the trees normally you can do a lot of other stuff but yeah um do you guys want to see how much this changed the the randomizer and how much more difficult this is going to be um so it, this was our options before i realized we have to do kinstone pieces but now here is what we can do with our remaining options now i already got the intro items in the smithy house so i can go ahead and just mark those off um lady next to the cafe mayor's basement malin's pot shrine heart piece minish heart piece okay there's really not very many things we can do now this randomizer just went to ultra hard mode i already put it to hard mode but now it's an ultra hard mode so Let's see how this goes. Kinstone pieces are in the dungeons, yeah? Oh, I mean, it's a randomizer, so the kinstone pieces could technically appear anywhere. This woman finds us attractive. I mean, she is correct. Here, we just found a kinstone piece right here. This is a golden kinstone piece, which means it's actually rare. And these ones are actually really rare. What shape is that? Okay, that's, that's a really good one to find. That allows us to get into the Veil Falls later. Okay, I actually don't like my tech speed. Am I able to save and exit? The tech speed is actually too fast, and it's causing me stress. Yo, what's up, Ike? Nice to see you. Guys, my buddy Swift Ike, who's in chat right now, he actually just did his own subathon that lasted for 20 days. And that is kind of what inspired this one, honestly, was him doing it. Cause I was like, if I can do it, surely I can do it too, right? <laughs> okay, that's not actually what went through my head. But I was like, it sounds kind of fun. I was like, I, I want to try to do it. So he was kind of my inspiration. He gave me some advice and everything. And so here we are playing rando for seven days, potentially. I think I have the same... Why is there a flower next to your name? TwitchCon Amsterdam. That's cute, I think. Did you go to TwitchCon in Amsterdam? Like, you live in California. <laughs> How do you have the one... The, the European TwitchCon thing? <laughs> Yeah, fortunately, I feel like a million bucks right now. Like, at the current moment, I feel like I have the energy. Go, bomb bag! Bomb bag! Right now, I feel like I have the energy to do this subathon. I got it within me bones. But re ask me that question in like six hours. We'll see how I feel. But I've been preparing for the subathon for the past like five days straight. I feel like I've. I've prepared a lot, but I still feel like I haven't prepared nearly enough. But that's okay. Definitely okay. Okay, bombs opens up a lot of shiz. Mo bombs, less problems. Mo bomba. I got Gorons calling. They love eating bombs. Gorons eat bombs and rocks. Like, that's badass. My confidence will dwindle. Oh, you're entirely correct. At least 60% of my self-confidence right now is coming from the cup of coffee that I had like four hours ago. Which I will renew that in probably a couple hours. But then eventually the caffeine kind of goes away and you have to go to sleep. Which I'm not planning to necessarily push myself to like stay awake super duper late. Like I'll probably go to bed at a regular time if I get tired. And then just like start the next day with fresh energy. Kind of just like do it like that. But for those of you who don't know, I will be potentially sleeping on, on stream. Well, actually not potentially. I think for a fact I will be sleeping on stream because I cannot stream for the next 15 hours without getting too tired. 
I think there's something inside. I think that blue rupee we just got was randomized. How did the Goron squeeze through the tiny hole? Yeah, he doesn't get tiny, does he? He just goes into pebble mode. Bulalam pebble mode. That's true, we also have Dwayne the Goron. He's like great morale support. But pretty much what I'm hoping is that doing like this long of a stream. Darunia! Damn Darunia! Wait, did it go up by another like couple hours? Did I miss something important? I feel like I'm gonna miss a lot of important stuff during this stream because I'm just one person. But, interesting fact is I am, uh, I have some paid assistance for this stream, believe it or not. Because, because the way Subathon works is if I stream for all seven days, there's like a pretty much guaranteed income. And so I was like, okay, so if I'm gonna make this much money, how could I reinvest some of the money I'll make into making sure this Subathon will be better? So I was like, let's hire some, holy crap, Tommy! <laughs> you son of a grip, you crazy son of a bitch. I was like, no, you're not just a son of a bitch. You're a crazy son of a bitch. The best kind of sons of a bitches. Yeah, we're at 16 hours all of a sudden. Damn, that just goes up way faster than expected. <laughs> are we on a hype train right now? That We are, I think so. Oh my God, Sarukana. <laughs> Yo, wait, I'm, I'm trying to pull my laptop up. Can my laptop die? My laptop battery is like the most embarrassing thing ever. Like honestly, I would never take my laptop to a battery store because it would get bullied into submission. I'm just trying to look at my stream alerts. I just, I just want to see my recent events, please. We're already up to 16 hours. Okay, so I've been streaming for 45 minutes and within 45 minutes, the stream went from four hours long to 16 hours long. I, I can't even mentally process, honestly. Streamlabs, okay. Yo, Evil King, thank you so much for the Prime for three months. To Lil Luna, thank you so much for the Prime. Thank you very much for the, for the bits, Blackjack. Can we just do something real fast? I wanna do a small experiment. For anybody who has them, can you guys donate just like small amounts of bits like in between like less than 10 bits i want to see if like a bunch of you donate like a few pennies if the tracker will just go up by seconds I feel like that, it's a little experiment to see how accurate this tracker is like when it comes down to seconds i think the tracker can go over 24 hours i'm not entirely sure i haven't like here we go does it go up like when the alert comes through? Hey, so yeah, even if you guys donate just like a few pennies, like you can make it go up just by like a few seconds. <laughs> Somebody can make the minute that never ends. The never ending minute. Cool. Well, I'm glad to see that that's working. Like plan. This is this is fun. There's a lot that's going to be happening during this stream. Uh, it's a lot to mentally process. That's the one thing that like I'm afraid of is the fact that whenever you stream, why did I shrink myself again? I'm so dumb. There's just a lot to mentally process when you stream from like the games you're playing, the chat, all these things you're doing, like time, blah 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 blah, and so. After seven full days of streaming and that much mental stimulation, like, we're gonna have to see where my headspace is at. I have no idea. <laughs> I've never put my brain through this before. Can we, can we run a poll real fast of whether, uh, if we think I can even do this for seven days? I just, I'm just curious as to how much faith chat has in me at the current moment. Like, if they believe in me or they're like, mm. We know Tyler. He's probably not going to be. We're opening lots of shortcuts right now, which is really good. You can already go back to the Smith house. 
The Schmitty. <laughs> Thank you guys for all your pennies. I love it when you throw your dirty change at me. It makes me feel like a stripper. Damn. Oh wait. How come how come Twitch has to ban you from taking off clothes on Twitch? What if I want to be a Twitch stripper? They just said no. They're like there's they're like there's different websites for that. Oh yeah, I turned key sanity on. Fuck what I made all these randomizers hard as shit, and like, you know, when you make the randomizers, you're just like, you're having a good old time. You're like, yeah, we'll just check some check boxes. Yeah, I could, let's check this box. Oh yeah, sure, I'll add this option. How hard could it be? Then you actually play them and you discover exactly how hard it can be. We're back, we're back. This is what we have editors for when it comes to the videos later. Alright, we're down here now. We can... I don't think shrinking down right here will really do much for us, will it? I think we're just trying to backtrack. Oh, speaking of Jackbox, do you guys see a Jackbox extension on the screen right now? Because I'm just now remembering that I, like, turned that on, but I think it might still be there. Is there, like, anything appearing on the screen right now? Whoa! Nope. Okay, that's good. Um, maybe it only shows up if I actually link it to a game. But to explain what I'm talking about, I installed this new extension that should allow chat to play along. Like, the audience for Jackbox won't have to use a website or their phone. They'll be able to, like, I think just choose their favorite answers and interact with the games by clicking on the Twitch stream itself. Which I've never tested, so we're definitely going to have to see what that's like. But it sounds like it has some really cool potential. Sorry, I was trying to pull chat up again. Someday. Whoa. Nice. Um, as I was going to say, someday. I will buy another monitor that will be a dedicated Twitch chat monitor, and I'll have that monitor flip sideways. Flip that bitch sideways. That's how I like my bitches. <laughs> flip sideways. Hey Zell, are you the one who found the earth element? I haven't found it yet. Oh, the large quiver? Does that mean I have the bow? No, I think it means I just have the quiver. Oh, cool, you guys don't even need to see my key sanity progress because apparently they keep track of it on the map now. I don't think that was a thing last time, but that's really, really cool. Dayton, good to see you. It's, it's the two clan mascot. Glad to have you here. Happy birthday. Dude, the Goron looks freaking terrifying. Like it's about to smash the city. <laughs> These poor people. You can also use a flipped monitor to code if you're into that. Um, I, I don't know much about coding, honestly. Go get the nut! Chat, go get the nut! It's important. Nut for me, chat. So we can have the nut. <laughs> Zelda did this on purpose. Anybody who played too much Zelda as a kid is a little bit gay because of... Nintendo did it on purpose, though. That was Nintendo's goal, is to try to make everyone who played Zelda just a little bit gay. Pico, Rico, Poco, Tipo! But I'm a girl, I can't. Girls can be gay. I mean, I feel like... I feel like the word gay is kind of like the word... You know, like, square and rhombus? How a rhombus... A square, like a square is a rhombus, but a rhombus isn't necessarily a square. It's kind of like lesbians. Lesbians can be gay as well. You can be gay and lesbian, but gays are just like gays. Gays are like rhombuses. They can't also be a square or lesbian. Gays are just like gays. Does that make sense? I don't know if that makes sense. <laughs> anyway, so let's keep on running around this miniature town. <laughs> For 
for anybody who didn't pay attention to geometry class, you'll have... I didn't mean to blow this place up. My bad, my bad. Rupees. Nothing here. You're a parallelogram. What other... It go Okay, so it goes square, rhombus, parallelogram, then just polygon, I think? Is that the order? All lesbians are gay, but not all gays are lesbians. Yeah, that's a good way to put it, space. <laughs> it's gay, it's lesbian math. It's, <laughs> oh my God, we're finally like figuring out the details of lesbian math. It took a long time, but I'm finally teaching it. Why am I finding another quiver upgrade? Why? Okay, so whenever I find a bow, am I just gonna have like a thousand million arrows? Is that what's gonna happen? There's also trapezoid, rectangle, kite for Fortis. Oh god, there is a lot more. Okay, I think it goes square, rectangle, rhombus, trapezoid, parallelogram. No, I'm I'm really testing myself right now. My name is Festari. Dude, Festari sounds like it could be the name of, like, the most expensive sports car in the Zelda universe. You seem to be having some trouble with our language, don't you? He's gonna give us the nut! Chat, we're about to get the nut. Press 1 if you're excited for the nut. You should be able to find one in the Barrow House just south of here. Oh, wait. No, he doesn't give me the nut. He's telling me how to get the nut. Wait, is the nut randomized? Is the nut, like... In what? I'm pretty sure the nut was randomized to be a, be a blue rupee then, huh? Okay. We're figuring it out. I love these little archways. They're, they're so adorable. I hope someday they hire me to make the Legend of Zelda theme park and I can make an area themed after- Whoa! The mascot can't... Okay, is, is it disrespectful for me to call you a mascot, Dayton? Like, <laughs> I don't know if that's actually disrespectful. Dayton donated five gift subs to the two clan. Woo! Let's go. Thank you, Dayton. Extended that bitch a long ways. We love you, Dayton. Yo, Newt, how you doing? Everybody in chat say hi, Newt. Because he's probably going to be here a lot. So, give him a warm welcome. He's a very active mod. What is this? How many rupees is this? Okay. Not enough. That's the answer. I want more than that. It's not disrespectful to you. Okay. Just making sure. Your cow from the previous Minish Cap has appeared to evolve into a Goron. You appear to be correct. Why did I shrink down again? <laughs> Minish Cap, you know, the Zelda game that has a lot of shrinkage. <laughs> Whoa, okay, we get it. You vape. Who's vaping out here? Who's doing it? Not appreciated. I'm allergic to bullshit. Oh, we can't swim. Vape life, shrinkage life. Anyone going for a coffee run? We're gonna be here a while. How many of you guys have drinking coffee today? If you've drinking no caffeine today, give me a zero in chat. If you have had caffeine, tell me what type of caffeine you drink. This morning, I had some delicious Vietnamese coffee. Whoa! A lot of you guys don't drink caffeine? Wait, how do you guys survive? I don't think I've, like, gone a day without caffeine in years. G Fuel, nice! Go, let's go G Fuel. I haven't had G Fuel in a minute. I ran out of my favorite flavor, and so I just kind of gave up. You don't survive. Ah. 
Moments! They're on the other side of the water. Can I get them? Can I get them? You stay away. You stay alive through pure willpower. You gotta respect it. You truly do. I still can't believe the timer says almost 18 hours remaining. I wonder, like, a part of me wonders, like, how high it can go. Hmm. I don't know. I feel like we're going to figure it out because there's some crazy motherfuckers in the two clan, and I feel like some crazy motherfuckers are going to show up at some point. <sighs> and I'm ready for it. I'm ready for it. I'm going to go back up to uh, the area by the castle courtyard. Oh shoot, I think in five more minutes, I'm going to have to re-randomize the game that I'm playing. <laughs> we have five more minutes of Minish Cap, unless, I mean, it could land on Minish Cap again. That's, that's a possibility. But yeah, for every eight hours that are added on to the timer, I have to re-randomize the game that I'm playing. Roughly every eight hours added. Yeah, I'm gonna have a very, very long VOD from the stream. Maybe the maybe the largest VOD anybody has ever seen. Entirely possible. What does FAFSA stand for? Um Farting All Freaking Sunday. I <laughs> hey, we got the spin attack. Let's go. What does FAFSA stand for, chat? Give me a better acronym. I'm to it. <laughs> Although most people do probably spend their Sundays farting because they usually eat a lot of food for after church and stuff. <laughs> Fear all fatal spin attacks. Frank ate fancy sandals again. Damn it, Frank. Not the fancy sandals. Eat the cheap ones. Five afternoons at Freddy's. Sane Asylum. Sane Asylum. Did you really just short insane to apostrophe sane? <laughs> Do we count that? Fat ass full of some ass. Oh yeah. I like my asses double thick. I like my asses with the same consistency as an in and out double double. Sometimes if I'm feeling freaky and want my BBW, I want that 3x3. That three three. We do have the Pegasus boots. Train me again. The dash attack. Yo, what's up, Waja kids? How you doing? Nice to see you. Also, Casey, nice to see you as well. Five afternoons, farting spin attacks. Oh, don't fart the spin attacks. Oh, they just said I'm the finest student. Are they pandering? Give me that good old switchblade possession. Did I see your sub message? I will if I do this. Yo, thank you, Watcha Kids, for 30 months. She said, Am I too late for the subathon? Yes, you are too late. Sorry. Also, good to see you again, Tyler. Haven't seen you since that fire Lucagen rap. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That should have, would have, could have been. Watching Lucagen, should have, would have, could have been. Watching Lucagen, getting me to pop a grand no matter what the mood I'm in. Should, what should have, could have been. Always loving Lucagen. Um, and yes, yes, that's just it. I think Brando also gets this up. Thank you, Brando. Do the best. All right. Oh, we got the Hyrulean Bestiality book. Mmm, yes. Everyone's favorite. It was a tier three sub? You gifted a tier three? Brando gifted a three tier sub? Oh, wait, a tier three sub to Ryan Seda. Ryan Seda, are you still in chat? Did you just gift it to some random ass person, Brondo, who might have left, or did you like choose somebody who deserved it? Someone random? Okay. Well, Ryan, hope you enjoy your your tier three sub from Brondo. Woo -woo. I think I have shop sanity turned on. And they also have some money. So uh, let's go spend it that money. What is this? 
What is this? Faster split gauge. 80. Your sword gauge will fill up with power more quickly. I don't even have a sword gauge yet. That's a little bit early, but we take those. Okay, I think that's that one on the tracker. How much is this? 600 rupees for a oh, That's a freaking ripoff. This stream is the reason you re-downloaded Twitch. Aw. Well, I'm glad I'm actually giving some purpose to Twitch for some people. There's not that many uses. Aw, oh, Dayton gifted a sub to Mario. Aw, oh, this is the pure friendship that I've missed, honestly. Yes, I shall catch your chickens. Please catch three of them. Okay. Oh, I keep on dropping bombs in accident. Oh, I keep on forgetting this chicken. I forget we have to play this on hard mode. Okay, I definitely did this wrong. I had to learn first. Is that gonna go in? I hope so. I think the other chickens. I forgot that it makes you play the hardest version of the, the chicken collecting minigame. Austin said, Tyler, you're the reason I fell in love with The Legend of Zelda. Are you saying you didn't love The Legend of Zelda before? You found attacking two games? Hey, don't tell me to cluck off, Nate. Cluck you. Oh no, I can't even cross the bridge. I can't even do this right now. I think we need the uh, Rock's Cave or something. Maybe you can help out again another time. How much time do you think I have, woman? Oh shoot, we have to re-randomize this again, don't we? Okay, so since we've already gotten so many crazy donations, you have forced me to do this. We don't get to play these linearly. No, that'd be too easy. 